What's up, Iris family and everyone? This is your Iris Hailheart here to make a video and tell you guys about New Bullet. And in today's video, we are going to discuss about New Bullet build, New Bullet constellation, the best way to use New Bullet, and the teams for New Bullet, and lastly, and the most important, future of New Bullet. And this video take me a lot of time, so I hope you guys will like the video and like my content and support me by liking the video, subscribing to the channel and join the discord, link in the description and most important thing, special shout out and very very much thanks to Sanjin Wo for letting me use his account for this new lit build video without him this video was really incomplete man we're any waste of time, let's stick to the intro and let's start the video <laughs> So first question is, who is Nuvillet? Nuvillet is a 5 star character, catalyst user and a vision of Hydro, is from Frontaine and is the judge in the court of Frontaine. Along with that, he has the very superior role in Frontaine. Now I'm not going to spoil that thing because there are still some people who haven't completed the Frontaine Archon quest and I know you guys don't want spoiler and as one is a Genshin Impact player, I will not discuss about that. But he is too much powerful and have a very crucial role in the Frontline Archon quest. What is the playstyle of New Bullet? Well, unlike other characters, New Bullet kit depends upon his charge attack. The more charge attack you can do, the more damage he will do. That means, unlike Barbara or Kokomi, who are basically healers but can still do some damage with their normal attacks or like spamming the attack button. New bullet attack depends upon how much you can hold that attack button or you can say the charge attack. Now the charge attack take a lot of time to loading as you can see in the screen but on the other hand if you tap the skill or go for the burst then you will get an intense amount of damage along with that you will not have to wait for that beam to load up. So it's an instant shot. Now to understand more about this let's take a look at a gameplay. Here as you can see, the moment Jivalin came, I used the skill and look here, the charge attack instantly gone into working which doing an intense amount of damage to Jivalin, making him immobile. Now look in the more closely, if you observe it, I go for the burst and now I do the charge attack doing the instantaneous amount of damage without any waste of time or straight in a row twice. You also notice that if you use charge attack of new bullet, the new loot will lose HP constantly. Now that's where the both skill and burst come into working. Not only they provide you this sudden cooldown of the charge attack duration, but it will give you some source for the droplets, which are basically the blue colored orbs. Now, the skill gives you three orbs, or we can say three source for the droplet here, will give you some HP and reset your time. On the other hand, the burst gave you a lot of source for the droplets, which allowed Nuvillet to keep them from the charge attack, which will heal him along with that allow you to do the instant charge attack twice in a row. Now moving on we are going to discuss the very third question, New Bullet Build. Now in New Bullet Build the very first thing, the weapon. Obviously his signature weapon, the Tome of Eternal Flow is one of the very best weapon for him. Not only give you the attack but also the huge amount of crit damage you are getting which is 88%. Though if you are not getting the Tome of Eternal Flow then sacrificial jade is also a good weapon for him which gives you a crit rate of 36%. Along with that if you are not able to get any of those weapons then you can go for the, the lost prayer of sacred wings which will give you 23% crit rate. That's for the 5 star. Now in the 4 star category the only best weapons we can think of are the wits and that is R5 wits and prototype amber. The wits will give you 55% crit damage and prototype amber gives a lot of hp bonus and we all know with the kit discussion that new Bullet needs a lot of hp now moving on on artifacts the very best artifact set for new Bullet is mauritius set and if not that then you can also go for four piece wanderer's troop and four piece heart of the depth now the four piece mauritius set will give you a total of 36 percent crit rate additional 
only if you lose or gain HP, which is quite acceptable on New Blitz playstyle. And why 36? Because it is stacked 3 times and one stack is 12% created bonus, which is 36, as 12 times 3 is 36. Along with that, the Wanderer's Troop of 4 piece will give charge attack damage of additional 35% which is only applicable if the character is a catalyst or bow user which is good for new bullet now for the heart of the depth the four piece heart of the depth will not only give you the higher damage bonus but along with that after using the skill will increase your charge attack and normal attack damage by 30 percent for 15 seconds but what if you started your game just few days ago and you got new bullet as you are so lucky in the game well Apparently you cannot go for the previous three artifacts which I mentioned just right now cause you need to be at AR50 to access that domain level which is very hard to get that level within few days. For that you can also go for Martial Artist 4 star artifact set which will at 2 piece increase your normal and charge attack damage by 15% and at 4 piece it will increase your damage for 25% for 8 seconds after using your elemental skill. Talent Priority for New Bullet Well, after discussing so far, we have understand that New Bullet Kit basically focus on his charge attack, his skill and burst. So with this in mind, we can conclude that we should focus on New Bullet's normal attack talent and work on it as much as we can and simultaneously work on the skill and burst as well. But the thing is, we should focus on skill slightly more than compared to burst as the burst require a whooping 70 ER in order to use his burst while you can use his skill after every 10 seconds. So therefore the proper way of building new blood talents are normal attack as your most priority then skill and then burst. Best constellation for new bullet. The very best constellation for new bullet are C1, C4 and C6 as C1 will increase his resistance against the attacks and interruptions he will get while powering up his charge attack or while doing the charge attack. C4 will give you more source, dropper, source water drop which will allow you to do more healing when using his charge attack after using the skill and burst. But that is more optimal when you have C6 cause at C6 you will get two additional instant charge attacks to do which means in the burst as we already discussed you can do two instant charge attacks simultaneously after using the burst but if you have c6 new bullet then you will do four charge attacks simultaneously and that is without any cooldown or interruption now best teams for new bullet as I already mentioned at the starting of the video that I don't have new bullet in my main account and I'm using my friend's account for this video. So after using the new bullet and other characters, I can say the very best team for myself is new bullet, Zhongli, Raiden Shogun and Furina. New bullet as a DPS, Zhongli as the shields, Raiden Shogun as additional electro damage as of off skill effect and Furina for both skill and the burst buffing. But after some thorough research and talking with other new bullet players and those who play Genshin time to time and the casual gamers of Genshin Impact, I came into the conclusion that there are not only that but you can also go for new bullet hyper carry, new bullet hyper bloom, vaporize team of new bullet, electro charge team of new bullet and freeze team of new bullet. I will discuss all of them in the following way. New bullet hyper carry. The New Bullet Hyper Carry team includes New Bullet, Furina, Kazuha, Baiju, and the second team is New Bullet, Fischl, Kazuha, and Zhongli. Now, this Hyper Carry team mostly focuses on buffing and enabling New Bullet as a Hyper Carry unit to do as much damage as possible. The second team category is Hyper Bloom team, which contains your DPS New Bullet, Sub DPS Raiden Shogun, Sub DPS Nahija and support by you. Now this team focuses on one of the most versatile elemental reactions which is Hyper Bloom and Aggravate as well. But to do more Aggravate and Electro Charge damage simultaneously, I recommend to use Fischl and Yaimiko as well. Instead of Yaya Ride and Shogun, we can use Fischl and Yaimiko as I say and Baiju for extra protection. The third category is Vaporization Team. Now this Vaporization Team includes DPS New Bullet, 
सब डी पी एस शाइनलिंग और फ्यूरीना सब डी पी एस शाइनलिंग और काजुहा एंड सपोर्ट बेनेट नाउ दिस थिंग इज इम्पॉर्टेंट एज वी शुड नो दैट हाइड्रो डज मोर डैमेज और वे से ट्वाइस शुड मोर एग्जैक्ट वेन ट्रिगरिंग विद वेपराइजेशन एंड वी नीड एनिमो टू इंक्रीज द पायरो इन्फ्यूजन अगेंस्ट एनिमीज आफ्टर यूजिंग शाइनलिंग और बेनेट स्किल एंड बर्स्ट नाउ द नेक्स्ट कैटेगरी इज फ्री स्टीम Now the free steam includes DPS Nuvolet, sub DPS Furina and Rosaria, sub DPS Kazuha and Venti, and support Lila and Charlotte. Now free steam will include the work of freezing the enemies. It will minimize your damage, but also do damage on your own. Using Kazuha and Venti will increase the AOE of either Hydro or Cryo effect on the enemies, making it easier for you to freeze them. The last team combination is electro charge team. The electro charge team includes DPS Nuvolet, sub DPS Fischl, sub DPS Kazuha or Bejo and support Zhongli or Sucrose. We can also use other off field electro units such as Fischl, Yai Miko, Bejo and Raiden Sugar which will allow you to do a lot of damage to a group of enemies. Future of Nuvolet. Now, by so far Since Nuvolet released in 4.1 and right now in 4.5, which is like four and five months of time gap, Nuvolet has earned the title of not only the strongest hydro DPS, but the strongest DPS one can ever get in the whole Genshin Impact till now. So I don't believe there will be any drastic or any massive change either with him or any other character for the time being. But we cannot stay sure, cause 4.6 is around the corner, which includes Alicino. 4.7 is clue range and there are no new characters in 4.8 but after that we get the netland or we can say 5.0 which will include blank which is the pyro dragon murata the pyro archon and other characters of netland but that is like four or five months more to go so for the time being new village is a very good and a very best investment you can ever go for lastly and once again I would like to thank again Sun Jin Wo for letting me use his account for this new lit video and it took me a lot of time guys so I believe and I hope you guys will support me and appreciate my hard work by liking the video subscribing to the channel and turning the bell notification on and 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 join the discord and become a member for our family the link is in the description with this I conclude this video and if you have any doubts regarding new lit kit build and any kind of the characters Then let me know in the comments and you can also join the discord and we can discuss about it now i'll see you guys later till then i will say hard signing off good night and good luck goodbye